What's up guys, so today we're going to be jumping down an old rabbit hole of a game called Game of War. Now, some of you guys maybe remember they have a bunch of like uh, commercials from like 2014, 2015. This game was pretty big. We're going to be you know, exploring it a little bit, talking about it. But yeah, I remember all the commercials that they had with Kate Upton. They, like, invested so hard into the commercials and whatnot that, um, like, you, you knew this game's a money pit. Like, every time you see something that's like, come in here and hop in the game and play it and da-da-da-da-da, and they don't actually show any game footage, then, like, you know automatically that the game's just gonna be garbage. Like, they're like, hey, look at all the CGI, and let, let's get you hyped in with the pretty girl and everything. Come on, teenage boys and simps. Let's get into it. And then it's just like, oh my god, this is nothing like the game. Like, we're, like wh when does the game start? What is this, a sad joke? It's like, nope, this is the game, bud. So basically what this video is about is uh, Game of War in 2021. And what you can expect when you play it. Let's get into it. Okay, let's uh, let's see what happens. Let's go look around a little bit and uh, see see what we get into. Uh, it says build an academy. All right, let's let's build the academy. Oh yeah, we're questing. Look, guys, we're doing it. We're we're becoming. We're becoming a hero. We're playing the game of the war. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hell. What, what just popped up? I, I didn't even... Okay. We'll just research monster tactics level one. Oh, my God. Kate, Kate Upton's calling me a king. Oh, oh, look, look, there's something flashing up in the right corner discount. Let's, uh, let, let's look at this. We've been playing the game for, I don't know, about two minutes. Okay, that's not being responsive up there. I can't click on that. Uh, let, let, let's look at the go. Oh, hell no. Oh. Okay, so we we got into the oh oh fuck oh god oh hell no forty nine ninety nine for thirty thousand. Fucking virtual gold. Oh, hell no. Oh, fuck that. <laughs> you think I'm gonna... Holy fuck. What the fuck is instant building 100? And why does it cost $100? Instant level 100 all main buildings advancement. So, all my main buildings go to level 100 right away. Or may maybe maybe they only level up 100 times. Or what? what? Oh my god. Draconic Expert Blitch Research Tome. What the fuck? There's 305 million. What the fuck? <clears throat> what the fuck? Th th this one's a hundred dollars too. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Why would anyone do this? Oh my god! Please don't spend your money on this. Oh, Jesus. 
This is so toxic. Ah. Uh. What? What's going on in here? Let's, let, let's go to the... To the kingdom. This isn't wanting to load. And I know it's not my internet. Because I have badass internet. Okay. Well, let's, let's... Let's go to the map. Maybe it's not open to us. The little chat thing. Well, this guy's getting raided. I think, or somebody's coming to him. He's a level two. Okay, what? Wait. So, the. Why the. F there, there was a level 90 back there. And, like, here are all the beginners where the little guys start and stuff. What the fuck is this? Um. No. What the fuck? Uh. Alright. <clears throat> Well, I'm just, like, right over there. Okay, well, this... Th this isn't concerning at all. The dude that has... 1.31 billion power and 114 million kills. That's... That's not... That's... Oh. Oh, fuck. This looks like fucking Disneyland. Oh my god, okay, 5.26 billion, okay, that's, that's fucking nice. And then this looks like, this is from like, I don't know, like, PlayStation 1 graphics or some shit. That's, oh my god, these guys are like right next door to me. Like, I just started out, right? Like, okay. Like, obviously, I'm not going to play this fucking game. But, like, I just started out, and then we got all the all the boys over here. Well, okay, just, just this dude. Just this scary son of a bitch. And he, he's... That guy's probably spent, like, a few grand on this game. And he's just, he's just pounding everybody's ass all throughout through here. And th what the hell is this? Oh my god. Oh hell no. What? Oh fuck no, dude. Oh god. This is horrible, like, like, you just start out, and then you're about ready to be gang-banged by all these dudes with billions of power, and it's like, oh my god. That's, that, that ain't even right, dude. Why, why, why is that a thing, man? Holy shit. I, I don't, I don't even know where I'm at, or how to get back to it. What is this? Oh look, cool. They they started me off with a pea shield that drops in 21 hours. Are you fucking shitting me? Oh, hell no. Oh my god. In 21 hours. That 5 billion... Power dude could just run in here and just take what he wants. That's horrible. There's a dragon, a hydro dragon, an inferno dragon, a terror dragon. Jesus fucking Christ. These guys can just come in here. Oh.
This game sucks. Don't play this game. Don't play this game unless you're a sadist. That's, oh my god. So, basically, to sum up the bullfuckery that we have just all experienced together, uh, you come into the game, and after 24 hours, you're fair game to dudes that have probably been playing for months, if not years, and have spent thousands of of dollars on this game right so after 24 hours you're fair game and those guys were right next door to me right and then when we looked at uh the packs they were really expensive that's that's super predatory that's super bad like and and j just like just like remember right like for the same price that that 5 billion power guy had, you could have probably bought a car, right? You, you could have probably bought a jet ski, right? You could have bought an amazing gaming PC, right? But instead, you, you, you just bought, oh my god, you bought so much virtual gold. Why? What? Why? Like, come on, man. Like, Jesus, th this game is just, like, designed to, like, just milk your teats until all of your money's in the bucket, man. I mean, like, like seriously, dude, you, you can be out there on the corner being like, Hey, how you doing, man? I'll suck on your feet for some Game of War money. Yeah, man, it's okay. I just need to buy me a boost pack for my dragons. Yeah, man. And for the last and final part of our journey, I thought we would go to the review section and uh, just check things out and see what other people think about the game. So right off the bat, we notice this sucker's got a 3.6. And uh, with most shady companies like this, they get bots... To come in and try to perk up the numbers so with such a big game like this that's been out for a long time and uh, had so many bots spam uh, five stars for it and give it like these uh, reviews that are almost perfect English but not quite you know like we, we all know what what's up with those like they're just like great game five stars you know and then like maybe something like, is misspelled or something generic. But yeah, like, right off the bat, a 3.6 with all their little helpers and stuff in the mix. Like, that's that's pretty bad. But, like, let's, let, let's look at their recent reviews. Uh, this guy put a 1 star. Lack of new content. Uh, see right here, he's talking about uh, how the game's made to suck out all your money. Yep. I played this game since 2014. Okay, so like right around the era when I was first seeing the commercials, it was fun, but quickly turned into pay to play. Uh, the game was sold last year. Honestly, I had high hopes that it would return to the game, uh, to the old ways, and nope. Okay, so he's lost all faith in it. Uh, pay to play scam, do not play. Yeah, um,. Then you have to start paying more money until you get the hundred dollar packs. Yeah, yeah, we were seeing those like that. That shocked the hell out of me. Um, was once the greatest downloaded game in 2014 and even had a Super Bowl halftime commercial. I remember that. They ruined it with updates. MZ should have stuck to tier four standard troops. And upgraded buildings instead of taking troops up to tier. F Whoa, shit! So they went from tier four to tier fifty, and realizing they messed up soon, and then introducing demigod. What the fuck? There, there, there's a demigod in this. Oh wow! So like, like they they just put such a massive paywall for people to hit the very top, but you had to like pay, like. 
Camaro money to get it or something. Oh my god. General dreadful refusing prices. Uh, Stella Pen, this game was fun at the beginning. I think this game is a psychological experiment. It's full of bots, not real players. Peace. I mean, I, I've seen people that have, like, been capable of, like, making basic bots for something like this. Maybe to, like, help them farm. But, like, I, I think she's just, like, she can't understand how there's, like, people out there that are willing to, like, sell their kidney to buy, uh, virtual gold tokens. I, I think that's what she's having problems comprehending. Um, just some normal stuff. People complaining about the game. Starting an account but can't get anywhere. Events are up for higher level accounts. Yeah, to, like, feed the dudes who are burning money, man. Like, Leonard... Dude, you don't matter to these guys. And then right here, this this kind of seems like a bot. Like, it can be very expensive. It's the only downfall the game has. Well, dude, I mean, that, that's kind of like the whole concept of the game. Spend money and wreck people who are poor. Or, you know, like, don't feel like investing their hard-earned cash into this. They, they want to put it into their 401k. Tax cost too much was better when imp was level 20. Now high. And with COVID, can't purchase. Uh, was good. I think he means good early years. Now a complete money game should be banned. Yeah, I agree with you, Randy. Uh, Google user. I liked this game when it started years ago. You need a strategy, planning, calculation of troops for every attack, etc. But all you need now is money. With about 300 into the game. Jesus Christ, dude. You can go out there. You can get an Xbox One. You can get a PlayStation 4. You know, like for that price. And this guy put it in here. Plus 200 dedicated tablet invested in the game so so he spent three hundred dollars right in the game and that purchases and two hundred dollars on a tablet all right so for that you get a playstation 5 and an xbox series x i was barely surviving because there were people who spent that much every couple of weeks so i'm thinking couple as a two or three uh, and some really rich people who'd spent thousands, thousands every week, dude. All that meant was I could never survive against them unless you can spend a few thousand dollars on a game. Don't play. Holy shit, dude. Right, right there, right there, right there. This guy, this guy told us all we need to know about this game. That dude right there, God bless him, because, dude, that guy went through the trenches to tell me that unless you spend thousands of dollars on this game every couple of weeks, like, don't expect to win. And le let me tell you, if, if, if you want to get into gaming, please, for the love of God, you know, go out there, support indie developers, or even buy a $60 AAA game, right? The, the ceiling on a video game should be, I mean, no higher than $100. Like, past that, like, oh my god. Like, like 60 is what a, a AAA game cost, right? Thousands of dollars every couple of weeks is bullshit, all right? And you are making extremely poor life decisions if if you, you can, A, support that, you know, and B, you know, continuation of this is you choose to put your hard-earned cash into this. Like, why? And then... All these guys are saying the same damn thing.
Oh, Jesus. Oh, dude. Oh. Avoid like the plague unless you have very deep pockets. This game is all about profit for the makers. It's impossible to get very far unless you buy their $100 pack, which are mainly full of rubbish and as full for a support department as totally non-existent. The game is also full of glitches, which never get sorted. Yeah, I think we found one of those. Play at your peril, you've been warned. Yeah, I wouldn't sink money into this fucking dumpster fire. Yeah. Yep. Everyone, just about. Yeah, nothing under $15. Even the dude who gave it three stars, nothing under $15. And then... Just one stars. Sometimes we'll get a three. Oh, there's a two. Oh my god. Well, I think... I think that should wrap it up.